It's the twatwa twa twa before making love for us. Oh, twa twa. Yeah. Oh, the prayer. Twa twa is the same. Yes, of course. The, the prayer before twa twa for oh. us. Okay, let me tell you. I was looking for somebody to ask me this question. <laughs> I don't know if people understand. That toilet, it's a toilet and a bathroom in one place. Yes, so that's oh. how we started. Uh -huh. So you go, bro, ume ume umoka. I mean, <laughs> And welcome, my name is Kalondu Musimi Kamakaida. When you see me, it's an exclusive interview about to go down. And seated next to me is a gorgeous woman of God. Oh my goodness, she is looking amazing. Please give it up for size eight, Mambo. introduce <laughs> Oh my goodness, is it Kwanza? You are looking like a princess, like a bride. Uh, talk to us about what you're wearing. I was stuck, I didn't know what to wear, I didn't know what to do. Then I called my friend from White Rose Bridal Kenya and imagine this was shipped from Turkey. It's straight from Turkey. Yes. It's straight from Turkey. She's a beautiful sister of mine. It's straight from Turkey. Everything. She's here. It's straight from Turkey from White White Rose Bridal Kenya. Kabisa. You know, people really, you know, ship things like for, for their for their wedding and for everything. But for you is, uh, you know, for the launch of Oh Sister. Oh my goodness. And first of all, you're looking amazing once more. It's good for women to look good, to love themselves and to come out looking fabulous. Yes. Now to go up to, you know, uh, for O Sister, right? Talk to us about O Sister. To mona the teasers, and we are like, me na no na tu malume sem. Wanya maza. Talk to us about O Sister. O Sister. Oh, I can. Oh, O Sister is a beautiful, real show full of Jesus girls. Yeah. Okay, and we are okay. Of course, our goal is to represent Jesus Christ, but on top of it, it ikona realness. Uja uta pata kwa mashows mingi siko baya. As in everything you see is real. Hakuna ma script ma script ma Script, mm -mm -mm. real things, real things. Yeah. Yes. And then the very first time we saw the teaser, uh, most people were like, ah, yeah, uh, gospel, gospel, you know, women of God coming out kutuanyesha reality. Atuta kwa tunawa judge. No, you know, let me tell you something. That's why I love O Sister. Because you are not supposed to worry what man says according to the Bible. You're supposed to worry what God says. Now, most of the time, unapata watu wengi wenye, not all, but most people who want to pretend to be someone else just because they are born again. But it's good to be real because mwenye nakuona sini mungu na nakuona inside out. So mbono udanganye wengine. Now, the one who matters is Jesus. Akikuona, ato kinjifanyo na nisraelia, nandani unanyangu ya kwenda so that's why I love O Sister uh, because I like people to see that you can be born again full of Jesus Christ. Like in this year, we are perfectly imperfect. Yes. So, uh, you know, coming up with O Sister, Uli, 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 Ambiwa, Uka, Receiver, Call, Uka, Ambiwa, you know, uh, come, let's do this. And what made you ku accept that particular call? I got the call and I was asked if I can be a cast of O Sister. To be honest, the reason why I accepted was because it's all about Jesus. It's all about Jesus. If you look at these faces behind us, these faces all have Jesus in their lives and that's why I agreed yes and I said I want a show that speaks to young people I normally do a lot of uh, high school tours and if you can see the issues those people go through the things those people go through so I felt that this is a way to get to them yes and I have been privileged to watch uh, the first episode right no <laughs> <laughs> Umekuwa master wa mafood, mambuzi, magot, manini. What should we expect from size eight? <laughs> me. <laughs> just me. <Yeah. laughs> just expect, okay. People who know me when they watch this show, it's just me. You know, we. yes, I'm a pastor also, but that doesn't mean I'm perfect. Okay, I'm first a, ma a woman of God. So I'm not perfect. I love Jesus Christ as my personal savior. But I also go through challenges just like everybody. Yes. 
And of course, also one of the things that we mentioned, Kule, ni <laughs> one of the things that you will meet DJ Mo Akiwa. <laughs> Akiwa kwa chosi, Jesus, ni struggling. Wow. You know, the first time I met him, I asked God, are you sure this is my husband? Okay. You know, God said, see him in the spirit. I went to pray and fast. Reka, da, 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 speaking in tongues. Bado tu naletewa, Samuel Moraya Kanyingi, that is your husband, DJ Mo. Hey, these guys are... Ben Paula, like, you know, that's what he said. That's what he said. Umse, ali kwa neji. Hey, as in, even, you know, joa, yani, what's that to say, it was humble big. Ha, ha, ha. But when I saw him, I want to talk. That's why I love this show. I get an opportunity to talk to young girls. You know, I didn't meet DJ Mo as top at the top. He is now doing well, giving me a very good life. You can see. But that time I met him, Ali Kwangayani too, and Wananza life. And eh, Gariake, Ali Kwatu in Ajaribu, Nyumba, Ali Kwatu in Ajaribu, Kila Kitu in Ajaribu, Chona, Bafu, Ziko Pamoja, Zimepatana. So, so, so at least Zimeachana. <laughs> yes. So this, that's why I like this show because we talk about things that we normally don't talk about in the public and to encourage girls who are watching me wa unataka tu mtu amekuja una silver platter eh ameletwa na saani ana drive range rover anaishi lovington am eh kila kitu on a silver platter but you when god tells you there's there's a there's a kapua man there and that is that is your husband you don't want to pray in the spirit and agree to god for him to become who he is yeah. yes when when God kept telling you about DJ Mo being your husband, ulikuwa kwanza reluctant to like no, this can't. Wacha ni sema socks ya meingia socks ya bari yako. Asante, asante kai. Eh kuja kuja hapo usalimie watu kidogo. Eh hiyo ndio socks. Eh socks ya amekuja. Socks wewe ndio MC wetu. Oh my sister. Hi. How are you? How are you? Yeah, you? Yes, undi undi brother ngu for very long. Yeah. Yes, very long time. <laughs> sana sana sana. Na nikimuona amefika hapa mpaka kwa billboard. Yeah. Billboard. Jehovah bro, ametuosha. Na reality show. <gasps> My friend, yes. ah, you are doing well. Ah. You are doing well. Ah. You are doing well. We are doing well. Thank you. Eh, Thank you. and it's just the beginning. Just the beginning. Eh, ndio sasa tu uko kwa runway. Yes. Sasa ndio una get momentum. Hii yes. mwaka ni ile mwaka bana. Hii yes. ndio ile mwaka. Yes. Eh. Anyway, so I love this show because the the fact that this show uh, is just a platform for even issues to be talked about in a real way. I can enjoy the show, ma'am. I can enjoy. And, and uh, me watching it and seeing people laugh about when you're when you're too normal, when it's just a normal, you know, everyday life. I am excited to also watch more episodes. And of course, Pia, uh, DJ Mo, to know snippets of him. Are we going to see him more in other episodes as well? Yes. DJ Mo is my husband. So, where, where size 8 is, DJ Mo is part and parcel. Many episodes, Mutamona, he is my hubby, and I'm penda baby, and I'm penda. I am in your simiake, I'm a fika. Oh. <laughs> So, yeah, you'll be seeing my husband in the show and you'll be seeing more of the Moriahs in the show to the glory and honor of God. Yeah. Yes. Uh, do you have a favorite, you know, sister in the show? Wow, what is this? What is this? What is this? What is this? Okay, I, let me say my history with them so that you understand why. Uh, someone like Lady B, I've known her for many years. For many, 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 to what I've done, don't pamoja. So, name is Lady B for many years. So, we are very close. I think the next person I, I came to know was Ndanu. Ndanu, Priscilla Ndanu there. I was her maid of honor in, in, her, on her, in her wedding. Akiza Jabali nilikuwa apo. So I think those are the two that we, we've come from really way back. Alafu, of course, Nika the Queen. My lovely sister. To Medjuana for, okay, for a very long time. And then J.O. She's one of the mentors I have in marriage. This lady has been married for the past 26 years. And I respect her. Ano ungeanga na nipeanga wisdom. Kwa saingine na kuanga na wenda wazimu. Saingine ni kama moto imepanda. Ana zima na ka wisdom. So she, she, she is also very close to me. Mili, of course, tuna, Mili na mjua uh, through our, our day in, day out. The moment they came, before even because the, before they started their their channel and then of course betty bio my 
friend from a long time ago so yes so nime wa introduce in a good way yeah you must say unakuwa na wenda wazimu all the wenda wazimus we are not going to filter it's going to be on the show zote zote because uh, let me tell you something why why reality reality shows sometimes don't do well is because you are trying to paint a picture of a perfect person there is no one perfect in this world except christ who walked on this world i am a pastor i run a church i have a service every friday but i'm not I'm, i don't preach from a point of perfection jesus is my perfection yeah. yes we would also want you you and D, uh, lady b as well to also take us through is on my days and you look on some of come now to dom as well moja tu na to dom to go to even ambiana eh mami tunatoka club za ine asubuhi Well we'll take you back there episodes where we talk about what we did how we did it where what happened yes yes what is the best part of the show the best episode you've shot yet my best episode what was my best episode akitko na mingi mzuri mzuri siezi kuambia siezi siezi kuambia i'm not allowed to disclose <laughs> but let me just tell you guys it's going to get hotter yeah and there are things about me i've never said anywhere in public you will hear them in the show yes. there are things akinanda nu lady b mili mili wa jesus janet o oh, they've never talked about these things in their entire life you will hear them in the show yes yes it's the twatwa twatwa before making love for us Oh twatwa. Yeah. Oh the prayer. Twatwa is the same. Yes, of course. So the, the prayer before twatwa for us. Okay, let me tell you. I was looking for somebody to ask me this question. Umechelewa. And now nimekuuliza. Let me tell you when I said it, I saw it on blogs and guys were laughing and blah blah blah, blah, blah. because they don't know that life is spiritual. Let me tell you something. I'm not saying atunashika unaanza before you have sex na mtu wako unaanza rakadabo. Rikadadadadadadada. Oh shake up ana. Yeah. Unaomba kindani nda? Kindani nda ni like for example you pray silently in your heart. You pray silently in your heart. Let me tell you why. Are you single? I am very single. Planning to get married. Yes. Now listen to wisdom. Now God does not God God loves to uh, atwa between husband and wife. It's actually worship unto him. But the devil hates to atwa between a husband and a wife. Ask people wale wanaibanga wanaibananga before ndoa. Wakiibana before ndoa alikuwa anachachisha hiyo kitu ilikuwa safi. Wanaibana wanaibana mambo iko sawa sawa. Wakisha sema yes I do. Eh eh. Si mnajua mkiibana shetani anataka anafurahia mkisin. But the moment you say yes I do, ask many couples. They don't know what happens. They are sex blah, blah, blah. no sorry. Sensor ta the two two life just goes down. And I am by the way invite me another time we talk about this in details. Yeah. I am willing. Yeah. Because most marriages are breaking because twatwa is not working. That's why you need to pray. By the way that's why to I, and I said I'm going to do a ladies meeting to teach women to travel in the spirit. Ukijua bwana ametoka for example is not around pray for your twatwa. Pray because what I'm going to the devil is real. Ataki watu wameokoka wapatane. And not what we are what we married so if you know you are married when your husband comes you don't have to pray now baby let's hold hands and pray no pray in your heart you are just praying in your mkotwa po yani mnaambia na oh i love you in your heart you're saying father lord i bless you those demons that whisper to women telling them unajua ukiolewa sasa hiyo pepo inaanza kukuongelesha everything negative about your man inaanza kukuambia negative inaanza ku whisper so that's why you need to pray because for a woman for you to enjoy to atwa you need to be focused yes sasa shetani attack is you anakutupia unastuka na ongei kitu openly yes we have to talk about it mama eh shetani anaanza kukuongelesha so though you tell the holy spirit i block every negative word that the devil is trying to tell me against my husband i block every negative word that the devil is trying to tell me against anything that will make this thing not be good holy spirit help me yeah. yes have you understood now i have understood and i have understood the fact that you don't shout what and kwambia tulikuwa tumefanya interview kwa diana chacha and if you go to her youtube channel diana chacha's youtube channel i actually said you don't shout unaomba ki kimoyo moyo kindani ndani are you getting me 
and because it will, if you shout, it will spoil the mood and everything. So you pray inside, inside, and you tell God take over. And even now, when you, it's not about that thing, maybe in your prayer time, also pray for your, pray for. Let me tell you, my must pray for your sec, for your twa -twa life. Pray for your twa -twa life because the devil is real. The devil's agenda is to break marriages. Are you listening to me, the people who are watching me? The devil's agenda is to break marriages. So invite the person who created to a tour before you do it. You don't have to shout it. You don't have to be loud about it. That will spoil the mood. Pray inside your heart. And when it's not time for to a tour, when it's your own prayer time, pray. Pray about it. Pray. And the people who are watching me, allow, thank you for this opportunity. And you are like, say, say it me, kuangu wa kunanga yu tu watuwa. Jifunze kuomba. Jifunze kuomba. Some people see themselves with a man in the dream. They, they tu watuwa with a man in the dream. In the physical, they don't have uh, urge. They don't have urge for their husbands. Your marriage is under attack. Pray. Look for me. I will pray with you. And you will see revival in your home. Yes, and we hope also DJ more praise before Twatwa as well. And do I do? Me to do I do? See, go quickly. I guess it's number silently. At that minute, Kiomba, Juangi, Kiomba. Yeah, yes. And I could just go around and I want to see Muyake. Mulize. Yes, this is it. You moved your church. I'm not in CPF now. I got a permanent venue. We are at Triangle House along at the junction of Globe Roundabout and Kirinyaga Road. Kule Globe Roundabout na Kirinyaga Road na Shikana. That is where we are at Triangle House. Every Friday from 5.30, kuja kanisa, tutaomba kuhusuizi mambo deeper and deeper and you will see revival in your marriage. Yes. So is it, where can we watch Oh Sister? Oh Sister is at Maisha Magic Plus, channel 160. Eh, yeah. Channel? Channel 163 on DSTV and channel 8 on Go TV. So Maisha Magic Plus, that is the channel. The decoder is DSTV, channel 163, or Go TV, channel 8. You find O Sister Friday, Kwanzia, this Friday, 7th of April from 8 p.m. Yeah. Thank you so much, Saizet. We really appreciate and of course also for the encouragement, the word, the lesson and everything. Asante kunipea interview. Nimeono menipenda. Ata mina kupenda zaidi. <laughs> well, thank you so much also guys for watching. My name is Kalendu Musimi. Behind the camera is the one and only Saidi Abdallah. Bye. Tuambia bye. Tuambia bye. <laughs> thank you.